For millennia, the pyramids of ancient Egypt have stood as awe-inspiring feats of human ingenuity and engineering. These colossal stone monuments, towering above the desert sands, have long baffled scholars as to how they were constructed with such primitive tools and technology. However, a groundbreaking new discovery may finally shed light on this enduring mystery. A research team from the University of North Carolina Wilmington has uncovered evidence of a long-lost branch of the River Nile that once flowed near the famous pyramid complexes of Giza, Darshur, and Lisht. Utilizing cutting-edge radar satellite imagery, historical maps, geophysical surveys, and sediment coring techniques, the scientists were able to map the course of this ancient waterway, now buried beneath the desert. Dubbed the Aramat branch, derived from the Arabic word for pyramids, this extinct river channel extended for approximately 64 kilometers or 39 miles and ranged from 200 to 700 meters or 656 to 2,296 feet in width. Remarkably, the researchers found that the Aramat branch bordered no fewer than 31 pyramids, constructed between 4,700 and 3,700 years ago during the Old and Middle Kingdoms of ancient Egypt. For years, archaeologists have speculated that the ancient Egyptians must have utilized a nearby waterway to transport the immense stone blocks and materials required for pyramid construction. However, the precise location and characteristics of this hypothetical river remained elusive. The discovery of the Aramat branch finally provides tangible evidence to support this theory. According to the study's authors, the proximity of this ancient river to the pyramid complexes suggests that it was active and operational during the construction phase of these pyramids. This would have enabled the Egyptians to harness the river's energy to move the massive stone blocks, rather than relying solely on human labor, a significantly more efficient and less arduous method. The researchers believe that a severe drought and sandstorms, occurring thousands of years ago, ultimately led to the burial and disappearance of the Aramat branch. This environmental catastrophe likely transformed what was once a fertile landscape, nourished by the river's waters, into the arid desert we know today. The discovery of the Aramat branch not only helps to explain the logistics behind pyramid construction but also offers new information into the lives and environment of ancient Egyptian civilization. By studying the sediment cores and archaeological remains along the river's course, researchers may uncover valuable information about the region's past climate, vegetation, and human settlements. Furthermore, this finding reinforces the notion that the ancient Egyptians were highly skilled in surveying and engineering, as they strategically positioned their monumental pyramids in close proximity to a reliable water source crucial for transportation and sustaining the workforce. While the discovery of the Aramat branch represents a significant breakthrough, many questions remain unanswered. Future research efforts may focus on determining the precise time frame during which the river was active and its role in the rise and fall of various dynasties. Additionally, exploring the potential existence of other buried waterways could further illuminate the complex history and engineering marvels of ancient Egyptian civilization. As modern technology continues to advance, archaeologists and scientists are better equipped than ever before to unravel the secrets of the past. The unveiling of the Aramat branch not only provides new insights into the construction of the pyramids but also helps explain the remarkably high density of pyramids concentrated between the ancient sites of Giza and Lisht an area that is now an inhospitable expanse of the Saharan Desert. Just days after the groundbreaking discovery of the Aramat branch, another team of archaeologists announced a fascinating find near the iconic Great Pyramid of Giza. Utilizing ground-penetrating radar and electrical resistivity tomography, they uncovered mysterious structures hidden beneath the sands of the Western Cemetery. Among the anomalies detected by the scanning equipment was an L-shaped feature appearing to be an entranceway leading to a chamber approximately six feet below the surface. Filled with sand, this structure extends nearly 30 feet further down, prompting speculation that it could be an unknown tomb intentionally sealed off in ancient times. The L-shaped anomaly measures about 32 feet long and 49 feet wide. A second structure was also detected nearby roughly 32 feet in diameter, which researchers believe could be an open void or a mixture of sand and gravel. The Western Cemetery at Giza is the final resting place of King Khufu, the pharaoh who commissioned the Great Pyramid, as well as his family members and high-ranking officials. The presence of these newly discovered structures in close proximity to the pyramid complex suggests the tantalizing possibility of an elite tomb, undisturbed for over 4,500 years. According to the study authors, the shape of the anomalies is too sharp to be a natural phenomenon, lending credence to the theory that they are man-made structures. 
They speculate that the L-shaped feature could be the vertical shaft and entrance to an underground mastaba tomb, a type of ancient Egyptian rectangular tomb typically constructed from limestone or mud bricks with a flat roof. The discovery of these potential tombs could provide more details into the burial practices and rituals of the ancient Egyptian elite during the Old Kingdom period when the pyramids were built. Studying any remains or artifacts found within could shed light on the lives, customs, and beliefs of those who lived and worked in the shadow of the great monuments. Moreover, the location of the structures within the Western Cemetery suggests they may have been intended for individuals of high status, perhaps even members of the royal family or those closely connected to the pharaohs responsible for the construction of the Giza pyramids. While the true nature of these subterranean structures remains a mystery for now, the researchers plan to conduct further investigations to unravel their secrets. Careful excavation and analysis will be required to determine if they do indeed contain tombs, and if so, who may have been interred within. While the pyramids of ancient Egypt have captivated humanity for centuries, these iconic monuments and the land surrounding them continue to reveal new secrets and archaeological marvels with each passing year. The recent discoveries of the Aramat Branch River and the mysterious structures near the Great Pyramid of Giza underscore the enduring potential for groundbreaking finds in this cradle of civilization. Despite decades of intensive study and exploration, Egyptologists widely believe that we have merely scratched the surface of understanding the full extent of ancient Egyptian society, culture, and technological achievements. The pyramids themselves, with their intricate internal chambers and passageways, may still harbor undiscovered spaces and artifacts that could shed new light on their construction, purpose, and the lives of those who built them. These remarkable discoveries not only pique our curiosity about the potential treasures that may lie beneath the sands but also offer insights into the engineering prowess of ancient Egyptian civilization. Moreover, the vast necropolis complexes that surround the pyramids, such as the Western Cemetery at Giza, are believed to contain numerous undiscovered tombs and burial sites each with the potential to yield invaluable insights into the funerary customs, social hierarchies, and daily lives of the ancient Egyptians. Thank you for watching this exploration into the remarkable archaeological discoveries surrounding the ancient Egyptian pyramids. As we have seen, these iconic monuments and the lands around them continue to reveal startling new insights into one of the earliest and most influential civilizations in human history. If you enjoyed it, Subscribe to this channel as we follow the trailblazing work of archaeologists, Egyptologists, and researchers all over the world tirelessly dedicated to illuminating the shadows of the past. Each new find, each fresh insight, brings us closer to understanding the remarkable societies that came before us and shaped the world we inhabit today. Until next time, thank you for joining us in witnessing the gradual unveiling of our ancient past.